What's up, y'all? Welcome to my channel, Spiritual Advice. Here, I'm back with the truth. Okay, y'all. I don't know. I'm getting chills in my body. I don't know why I'm getting chills in my body, but I'm getting chills over here. So let's just see what's going on with this with the energetic space, cause I don't know. Good. I don't know what the hell. Okay, let's see what's going on. I still got the cards sitting on the table from last night when I did the reading. So. Let me see what's going on with y'all. Oh, shit. Okay, y'all, let's see. Oh. What's the message for the collectors? Anything that they may need to know? I got to hear real quick. I got to, well, I ain't finna rush the reading, but I do have to get dressed because I'm, um, the kids having a, um, a balloon fight party. I, I had went about like, uh, 400 wild balloons and, you know, the little slushy thing and some more little stuff for them to have fun with and got yeah, water guns and, you know what I'm saying? So, we can just have fun today. Damn, okay. So, that, look, good news came out. So you, whoever you are, collective, you will be receiving some type of good news. Let's see. Um, uh, thank you all for, um, you know, you know, I've been getting a lot of people telling me about my hair. So thank y'all. Yes, I finally found somebody I can trust. It was no confusion there. So that's how I knew that I could trust that person. So, you know, it is what it is. There was no confusion with that. Okay, let's see. I appreciate y'all. Okay, we got Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. We have Scorpio here. So this is this who this reading will resonate with. Let's see who else. Taurus, double confirmation on Taurus. Water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. And then we have Virgo. <coughs> double confirmation. Okay. <clears throat> so whatever comes out in this reading, I'm talking about a water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Virgo, Scorpio, Taurus, uh, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, so, yeah, we got good news. So, some type of good news. <clears throat> somebody want to tell you something. I want to tell you, but I can't. It's like somebody want to come towards you and tell you something. Whatever this is, I don't know. You could be a Pisces or Aries. Did somebody want to come towards? Double confirmation on the Pisces because we do got water sign. So, you have to receive some type of good news. I want to tell you, but I can't. Somebody want to come towards you and tell you something. Something that happened in the past about something because I feel like, um... Everybody getting caught up now. You know what I'm saying? Whatever this happened, whatever this is that happened in the past. Yes, I'm getting like everybody caught. The lies we tell, the secrets we keep. Then I say somebody want to come communicate with you. Somebody want to tell you something, but they don't know how to tell it to you. It don't even matter because you over here doing your thing. Whatever this is, you can be, you can expect some good news and some communication as well. But I'm getting like the lies we tell, the secrets we keep. Somebody want to come tell you something about something that happened in the past. This is like a lot of fighting going on amongst people. You know what I'm saying? They fighting amongst themselves about what they did to you. Like, who played what part and what. That's what this fight is about. That's what this argument is about. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, I want to tell, but I can't. I'm going to have to take that. Like I said, you could be a Pisces or Aries. Somebody want to come tell you something. They don't know how to tell you. They don't know how to tell you. <clears throat> you could be a Leo or a Capricorn as well. Okay? It could be fake family members. You could be going through spiritual welfare. Okay? I'm getting like this all over. But family members, your family members is the main one that be plotting on you. The main one that's plotting. Yeah, somebody said you was a thought. What the hell? Ah, the last we tell the secrets we keep. One of them was that you a thought. Somebody finna come tell you some shit about something. Let's see. Let me, uh. I don't know what that was. I don't hear that. You could be from Texas. That's what came out. And look, great things are coming to you. So that's what I'm saying. Whoever you are, it's some good news, right? It's good news, great things that are coming to you. Okay? Expect some communication. But also expect some communication with somebody who did something to you in the past. I feel like it's all coming to the light now. You know what I'm saying? Stolen property. Somebody stole your property. I'm ashamed of myself. Yeah, I figure you would be. You know, I figure they would be ashamed of themselves. I figured it. Okay, so let's see. 
Yeah, because I'm definitely getting like you expecting some you you can be expecting some type of good news. Great things are coming to you. It's time for you to go in a new direction. You know what I'm saying? It's on the up from here. That's what I'm getting. I really saw if it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's stuck. Like <laughs> uh this shit, let me see what card on you. I wanna know what this great news is that you could be expecting. Let's see if I can get some out here. Who's this great news? Ooh. I guess I'll take it. It says stepping into a new experience. That's just good news. It's like moving forward, moving on. You see this person they got one leg in, you stepping into a new territory, right? It's like um it's time for you to go in a new direction. That's what you're doing. You're going in a new direction, right? You're stepping into a new experience. Things will not always be this way. You you moving forward. Okay, I feel like they want people want you stuck. It could be your community, because I see community right here. But it's like they want you stuck, but it's that's not gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? It's not happening. It, oh. Two minute cards. <sighs> These kids getting on my nerves. I don't know if y'all can hear them, but I can hear them. They getting on my nerves. Okay, it says shrewdness and resourcefulness, especially in business. So, um, we got relationships or, or with the dark com complete with a man. So, who, whoever this man is, I don't know. Um, trouble accusation. I feel like, um, yeah, if it's up, then it's stuck. Whoever this person is, it's a man here. Could be anyone of those signs that I called out, but they being very rude. Um, uh, it says shrewdness and resourcefulness. This is a fox. I'm, I'm getting sly. Somebody, this is a sly fox. Somebody watching you. Cause this person, really, look, this ain't no person. This is an animal. So I'm getting like whoever this person, whoever this man is, they're a fucking animal. You know what I'm saying? See how he look in the bushes and, and looking at you like trying to. It's like they want um, they keeping up some type of trouble accusation. You know what I'm saying? They keeping up some type of trouble. They could be watching you. They could be spying on you. They could be having other people watching you. Whoever this masculine is, is a. I don't know. It's a man, though, for sure. Okay, I'm gonna push it back up. It's a man for sure. Damn, I'm also saying, the hell is this love here for? I'm gonna leave that right there. I'm gonna leave that right there. Get some more cards. Clarify these cards. Let's see. Mm. Somebody like you. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, let's see. What is this? I, what is this I want to tell, but I can't. Somebody want to tell you some a legal program. It's something here about a legal program. Somebody know something about or know you was a part of this illegal program and they want to tell you, but they know that they can't. I'm here, all eyes on me, so all eyes could be on you. They're guilty. It's like a lot of somebody want to come back and say something to you, they're guilty of, okay? They're guilty of doing something to you that happened in the past. But I feel like, only, look, yes, only because, though, they're getting caught. You know what I'm saying? Only because they're getting caught. You could be a Leo, a Sagittarius. Somebody tried to sacrifice you, set you up, and sacrifice you to please the devil. Okay? That's what I'm saying. What is these lies? The, yeah, look, your enemies have been exposed. Point blank, period. The lies, your enemies have been exposed for the lie, for whatever they did to you, right? They happened in the, what happened in the past. If somebody stole your property, gee, this coming to the light. Hidden camera. So you finna get some communication in regards to a hidden camera. That's the secret. That's one of the secrets here, right? Um, that's what was done to you in the past. Whoever this man is, because it's a man here who I guess planted a hidden camera in your home or wherever. And I feel like that's how they was watching you to even take on this elite. Yeah, look. Sex video. I can't make it up. It's like, um, they they trying to like one up you right so if i if this is just say i place a hidden camera somebody has i can see everything they doing i can see you know what i'm saying like i'm even getting like somebody like stealing your ideas through this hidden camera you know what i'm saying like really watching everything you do 
or whatever this illegal illegal program was, it could have been the MK Ultra, could have been. Uh, I'm I'm also getting like the CIA doing this. That's what I just heard. The CIA did this. Whatever this illegal program is, the CIA is doing it to people, especially with supernatural abilities. You know what I'm saying? Such as myself. I've been through it, so you know I know. You know, trust me, I know. So this shit, you're in the community temple. Hmm. Something here about a hidden camera and a sex video. Okay. I'm ashamed of myself. Let's clarify that. Yeah, you you could be a psychic investigator that this happened to. It could be a private investigator that's watching you. So we got psychic investigator and private investigator. Whoever this person is, I feel like they also, I don't know, I'm, I'm getting like y'all y'all finna be good friends. Yeah, look, I want to work with you. I'm telling you, it's a psychic investigator, which is you, right? Whoever you are. And it's a private investigator here that wants to work with you. I'm getting like on down the line. It's possibly what y'all may be doing, working with each other. You know what I'm saying? And that's probably where this love come in, niggas. I'm telling you. Mm. Mm -mm. I want to work with you. I, I don't hear I want to love on you. Somebody really, really want to love on you. You know what I'm saying? Damn. Okay. <laughs> divine film. So you're a divine film I'm talking to? You got a private a private detector. A damn private detector. You got a private investigator that wants to love on you. That's what I'm hearing. I'm in love on top, baby. You're the one that I need. I can't stand her, but that's the song I'm hearing in my head. You keep my love on top. So you're the last film, and it's a private investigator that's watching you. So we got a private investigator, and we got a uh, psychic investigator here. Yeah, you was a part of some type of first million of your family. Whoever you are, you finna get some good news. I'm some uh, stepping into a new experience, like getting money, making like you ain't got to have no more worries about, especially about money, it look like. Mm. And if somebody wanna work with you, I'm getting like you you making good money doing whatever this is, the first billionaire in your family. They say millionaire, I said billionaire. Shit. Yeah. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> Why is this called look, Ace of Cups? I'm telling you, somebody want a new beginning in love with you. Yes, they do. And then look on the, on the other side of this card, I got love. I don't even remember writing none of this. Somebody needs to be honest about their emotions. That's what this card say. And I don't even know why I wrote this. I guess this supposed to be just been a message, and I wasn't supposed to forget it, so I wrote it down. And then I guess I wrote Ace of Cups on the other side, but it says love, um, emotions, new beginnings. Forget. I'm telling you, bro. Somebody want a new beginning with you. Somebody needs to be honest about their emotions. Somebody, this person ain't being honest with you. Well, I ain't gonna just say they ain't being honest with you. They just haven't told you yet, okay? They just haven't told you yet. But they want a new beginning in love with you. They want kids with you. Wow, okay. <laughs> so, I ain't know this people gonna turn to that. Yeah, I'm definitely getting some type of legal program, human experiment. Human experiment. Look. Uh, uh, murder on the live you that's what that's what the plan was that's what they thought but guess what that wasn't destined to happen I'm, but i'm gonna tell you what was what was this for you to happen was for you to get um for you to get this new beginning to move on it's like like i tell you all the time you was a trap for these people no now i say be careful who you entertain because you could be literally entertaining the angel and you was a fucking angel that was placed here for this very reason, you know what I'm saying? It's like, use the trap. You trap, use the trap. You know what I'm saying? They fell into the trap. Whatever this illegal human experiment, illegal programming is, they tried to unlive your ass behind it, though. But it wasn't destined to go that way. You had a purpose here. But somebody's gonna need to brace themselves because it's gonna go down. All these karmics, all these people are karmics to you, right? Mm. You were a threat to these people. You was a threat to them. You was a threat to them. It's crazy. Now they scared. I'm telling y'all, they scared. Look at it. They scared. Somebody, your dad scared too as well. Hmm. Let's see, I'm ashamed of myself. Let's clarify. I'm a, you got a doppelganger here. There's a supernatural business. Yeah, you got you you got supernatural business. So all this because of that. They will be. They was. They was warned. They were warned to leave you. Here. Ace of Swords, and that's the truth about the setup. Some of y'all is your auntie, too. Okay, so we got Ace of Swords. This 
the truth. That's clarity, right? There's you getting this communication, this clarity. I'm telling you, somebody wants to come towards you and tell you something. And I do believe they are. Whoever this person is, it could be this man here, whoever. It could be she, this somebody finna come towards you and tell you something. Whatever it is, just take it how it's gonna resonate. But somebody coming with some type of clarity, with some type of truth. Okay? I'm talking to you, whoever you are. I'm talking to a film energy. I got divine film here. I want to even be sweating and shit because you about to move on. You moving on. You you do healing work. I'm getting like you a healer. You a damn healer. I'm telling you, God said, let my people go. You got to let them go. You have to let them go. Y'all don't have to let them go. Ain't no, no more body dropping out from out my people. You know what I'm saying? Premeditated. This is premeditated. All this shit that happened to you, the community did, these five of ones, they just hit the flow. Then look, we got jail. And then we got five one on the other side. They ain't got no choice but to walk away. You know what I'm saying? It's, this ain't number confusion because they ain't finna go to jail. I'm telling you, they finna go to jail. Then we got divine femme here. We got divine masculine as well, right here. So I don't know if divine masculine is like they might have something to tell you. They might have been playing along with these folks too. You know what I'm saying? With your whole community to go against you. Maybe they didn't believe in um, Twin Flying Journey or whatever. But I feel like now they maybe they do. I don't know how this going to resonate. I'm also getting that whoever this private investigator is, it's, gonna, it's like high level soulmate engine, it's going to turn to your divine masculine. That's for somebody. So if somebody, if you do get somebody like a divine masculine trying to come back, they wrong you in the past, they will listen to everybody else, then, you know, that's a no-go. We're moving on. We're moving forward. I ain't doing no backsies. You know what I'm saying? If you chose somebody else over me, then let that be that. You know what I'm saying? Everything happened for a reason, but I'm not going to go back. You know what I'm saying? I'm not backtracking. You know, Ain't nobody finna backtrack. That's all I'm saying. It, it don't matter what you say. Yeah, I, I can try to forgive you. You know what I'm saying? I can forgive you and move on, move forward. But that's far as they gonna go. You know what I'm saying? It ain't gonna go no far. But like I said, I'm, I'm definitely seeing you, uh, film ends divine film. You get a new beginning. I'm seeing you get a new beginning in love. I'm seeing you get a new beginning in love. Um... Uh, what is called business wise I'm seeing like all these business opportunities you step into a new territory things will not always be this way uh, I don't give a fuck how long you been going through it it's, it's finna change it's finna change that's all I'm gonna say it's finna change yes sir it's finna change okay let's see let me get some more on this uh this, this masculine energy, this, um, it's a masculine energy here that you may have been dealing with. That, um, just telling lies and keeping secrets. It's like they came towards you knowing that it was some secrets that they may have should have told you. I don't know. They could be your divine masculine. I don't know. But they, they knew some secrets. You know, they knew something. They knew something and they didn't tell you what they knew. You know what I'm saying? Yep, and they may be feeling defeated. You know what I'm saying? Cause they know, ain't no, ain't no going back from this. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. You did what you did. It is what it is. Trying to move on. You know what I'm saying? Trying to move on. So what does this person want to say? They definitely not happy. They definitely not happy. They could be single, single parent. Nostalgia could be the false identity. They might be talking to you through like um. <coughs> <coughs> False identity, they're using the false identity to communicate with you. You don't even know it's this person, whoever you are. So, if you are a psychic investigator or anybody, you don't have to be a psychic investigator, you just be a film energy, you know what I'm saying? That's awoken, okay? Um, they could be communicating with you through false identity or whatever, or like I'm just definitely getting your, your identity was stolen, okay? Um, Nostalgia, they having sleepless nights. They can't stop thinking about you, thinking about the past and what they did. They know they gotta, it's like they wanna come communicate with you and tell you something about what they did. They could be up looking, staring at your pictures and stuff. And that, that, uh, caught on info being a dick. Uh, you don't even matter, cause I ain't taking these cards reverse. So let's see what else, what else, what this person wanna come tell you. Checking on you. 
I'm definitely getting with checking on you. They, they want to reach out. They got a phone in their hand. They definitely looking at your pictures, man. They, they can't sleep. They up just looking at your pictures. They may check on you through... Ooh, excuse me. False identity. They could be checking on you through false identity. By like, uh, you know, even if it's emailing you as somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Or some type of way. Or sending you firm. Because they just trying to keep tail on you. Look, revenge and pen and pension. They could be broke as hell. I feel like they was making money off you through this illegal camera with the sex video. They were making money off you. Now they get pen and pension around her. Pen and pension. They ain't getting that money no more. Look, insomnia. Yeah, yeah, sleepless night. That's another phone. But I can't make it up. And they won't. They trying to. Somebody want revenge on you. If it's not them, it's somebody. That's what I'm saying. I ain't finna backtrack. We ain't finna backtrack because I don't know what your motives are. I knew what they was then. I don't put enough passion. When you show me who you are the first time, I'm gonna believe it. What? What? Uh -huh. Huh. Huh. What? Alright, cut them TVs off. Cut them out, lap then. Just cut them off. Cause I'm sick of talking to y'all. Insomnia, you're copying. What the hell? Losing patience, cheating, reaching out. I'm definitely getting. Then I said they want to reach out. They want to reach out. What's they? What are their motives? I don't know, but they definitely want to reach out. I feel like whoever this masculine is, this karmic masculine. I'm gonna say that they want to reach out. And they could have had like they could have been dating somebody else that wants reven revenge on you. So let's just say you were talking to somebody, right? They came towards you, but they came towards you knowing that they knew certain things about you or they knew who you was. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I would give my example, but I'm trying to just not talk about myself so much anymore. You know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to like. They want to reach out, though. They want to reach out. Uh, but I don't know. I feel like they were dating somebody, and this person was copying you, copying everything you do, want to be like you, want to dress like you, want to look like you. You know what I'm saying? Like I said last time, this person don't even wear makeup. Maybe they seen you wearing makeup, and they think that this with this masculine, karmic masculine light, right? So they were like, let me be who this person is to him. Let me look like this. Let me dress like this. Let me act like this. Maybe he'll love me. You know what I'm saying? But And then they want to get revenge on you. Wow. Harmony. Yeah, creating all this damn turbulence. You know what I'm saying? This, But I feel like you're going to close the door. You know what I'm saying? you closing all old, old doors. you moving on. you moving on. you done moved on. That's what I feel like. But this person, I feel like they got a karmic that's fucking with you or something. But she, I don't, like, I already know you know not to, not to go back. You know what I'm saying? Not the backtrack because you are um, literally stepping into a new experience. That person could have had the same experience with you, but they cross you. You know what I'm saying? They cross you. And that's where they lost you when they cross you. You know what I'm saying? You got good news coming in. You stepping into a new experience. New love. You know what I'm saying? Ace of Cubs, you got new love over here. Your enemies have definitely been exposed. Great things are coming to you. You're going in a whole new direction. Why would you backtrack? That's why we got closing doors here because you close them old doors. You close them doors. These people was warned. They was warned. They was warned. They didn't want to listen. They didn't want to listen. You know what I'm saying? You can't. Come on, man. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. I don't know what they say. It say something about a tarot card reader. It said like, it say like tarot card reader come for. I'm not going to pick it up, though. But we got a man wanting to kill his son and his daughter. So, damn. <clears throat> Something's coming out about that as well. The lies we tell, the secrets we keep, and we got whoever this man is. Yeah, you, you can expect positive changes um, coming to you. But this man here, yeah, spiritual gifts. We know you got them. We already know. We already know. That's why they tried to throw you this surprise party, right? But um, you could be a Virgo, Capricorn. Yeah, go again, Virgo, Capricorn. There's too many cards. Let me clarify this. Um, uh, 
I'm telling you, you chose. You somebody who's chosen. I just say it. You got a lot of people fighting over you, too. I ain't gonna lie. You got a lot of people fighting over what was done to you. Look, a lot of family secrets. It could be your family as well. And we got a man wanting to kill. And then we got fighting. Whew. Child abuse, child neglect. So this man, whoever, I, I feel like, of course, you're an adult. You're not a child. You're a grown adult. But it's like still, even if this your father, a man want to kill his son, his daughter, right? Then we got divine film here. So you're divine film. And your father want to kill you for whatever reason. That's unalive you, right? That's child abuse, child neglect. I don't give a damn how old you is. Your father way older than you. But they know better. You know what I'm saying? Why the fuck? Why would you be sure? Why, why would you want to throw me a surprise party? What did I do to deserve that? That's your, you know what I'm saying? Family secrets. There's a lot of fighting going on amongst your family. People just fighting left and right. I'm telling you. Because you know why? Because your enemies have been exposed. That's why. That's why. You were going through a lot. Nobody truly understand. You know what I'm saying? What you were going through. What they didn't care to. It was a lot of pain on you. You know what I'm saying? You know that songs? Uh, well, how the songs go? Pain on me. Like you got a lot of pain on you. You know what I'm saying? It's been a slow process. I feel like it's been a long time coming. You just been, you just now getting your justice. Let me see if I can get some. Yeah, I'm gonna get some that's on this father here, cause they've been coming out a lot. Not just my readings, but a lot of people readings talking about somebody's father. Look, I did it on purpose. So yeah, your father definitely. I mean, it's here. It's in the cards. Uh, um, child abuse, child neglect. You know what I'm saying? Uh, want to harm your son or your daughter? You did it on purpose. You knew exactly what you were doing. You know what I'm saying? They knew what they were doing when they did it. it they knew exactly what they were doing. Yeah, and whoever you are, you had definitely had to stand your ground. Okay? You definitely had to stand your ground, and you did that. You did that. You could be a Pisces, or your father could be a Pisces. I get that a lot, too. Some of the fathers are Pisces, or you are. There's a comic film and a false twins. Thank you, Spirit. It was meant for to pick these dicks up. It was meant for to pick this dick up unexpected visitor. Okay, then we got love connection. So, let's jump straight into this. You know what I'm saying? It's like the reading just begun and we 27 minutes in. So, look, at, look. I'm, I'm going to talk about that in a minute. We're going to get to that in a minute. But we got Psychic Investigator. I want to work with you on Private um, Investigator with the love, right? Divine Film. There's going to be a love connection between you two. Okay, you can expect that because I said that. It's not here for nothing. Okay, you have an unexpected visitor. That's this, this, um, I don't know if they're going to unexpected visit. They might, somebody might show up at your home. I don't know. Um, but you definitely got some communication coming in. But you got a false twin in a karmic film. So when I said, when I told y'all that you, you was talking to somebody, whoever this person was that you were talking to, the lies we tell the six we keep, they knew, they knew something about you when they came towards you. They, maybe they knew you were chosen. Maybe they knew you were gifted because your father sent this person to you. Okay? They definitely something to you to knock you off your path, but it that wasn't destined to happen. Like I said, it was never gonna happen. So they sent this this karmic father sent this false twin. This false twin had a damn fam, a a karmic fam who they were talking to. Maybe the, and then I feel like this false twin was your hit man, right? So this hit man, of course, I talk about this all the time. So this hit man was talking to a karmic fam, and for some reason, what he was supposed to do. He wasn't never doing it. And, they, and I'm telling you, because I'm, I'm hearing it, they argue, they constantly argue, like, why you ain't do it? Why you ain't do this? Why you kiss her? Why did you kiss her? You know what I'm saying? Why are you giving her forehead kiss? You only give people forehead kiss that you look. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that, that's what I'm getting. They arguing constantly. I back and forth, like, you supposed to went to do this, but you didn't do that. Why you didn't do this? It's because the damn hitman fell in love with your ass. You know what I'm saying? They couldn't do it. You know what I'm saying? They just couldn't do it. <laughs> Usually the hitman, you know, getting rid of people that uh, I don't know. I guess they feel like they need to be gone about her. I don't know whatever it is, y'all. You know what I'm saying? But I'm definitely getting. He couldn't do it to you. You know what I'm saying? He couldn't do it. It, it wouldn't. It, God didn't allow it to happen. You know what I'm saying? So. And they had a karmic film, so this karmic film, like, well, you why you always looking at her pictures or you in the bathroom talking to her. Or, you know what I'm saying? Why this karmic fan following this man all around the house and shit? Like, da da da, kind of talking about you. You know what I'm saying? This is a karmic fan. So they's like, oh, okay. So to me, I think this, I think he like her. So let me do what she do. Let me try to look like her. Let me try to dress like her. Let me try to act like her. Let me try to just be her. You know what I'm saying? That's what she did. That's what she did. That's what this karmic fan did. But it didn't work. I can't make it up when I spit the dick. Karmic spine. Mistress. In love, woman crying, break up. Oh, they broke up. Or oh, they they broke up. Or oh, they breaking up. 
But that's that's her. That's her crying. Or this could have been you crying. You know what I'm saying? Either or. Somebody in love with you though, and I can't make it up. And this person ain't gonna ain't gonna make you cry, and you can believe it. It's gonna be happy tears, if anything. But I'm getting like karmic spine and mistress. So somebody said she was the mistress, but they really the mistress. Or even if you was the miss, I don't know. However, this however they gonna resonate. But I'm definitely getting though. Their relationship between them is over. But I'm getting like karmic. I'm getting like um. Karmic couples, or it could have been a karmic couple. He was already dating this person, or however it's gonna resonate. It if he wasn't, and you was the mistress, but I don't really think that. I'm not sure though, because I feel like whoever this person is, somebody. So if you was dating this person, some fan was like, "Well, I'm gonna just take this person from from her," or you know, however it's gonna resonate, I'm gonna take this person from. This shit ain't gonna work. I mean, you could take them, cause shit. I don't want. Don't know who want a false twin. Anyway, you know what I'm saying. And if you did have a um, a, um, a divine masculine or someone who's supposed to be used, you were sent to them as a gift, right? You was a gift, or they supposed to come to you and learn some lessons, or you know what I'm saying, trying to heal. But they, that's not what they did. They went against you with this karmic film or with the community, or you know what I'm saying. That's this what I'm getting. Okay. Yep. They finna get ready to go to prison. This karmic couple. A killer couple, as you say, they finna go to prison. They finna go to prison. They finna lay it A lot of people is finna go to prison. I see a father here. I see this couple here. I see a community of people. Um, yeah, I'll owe some damn money because this is about money. Damn. It's crazy. And then look, somebody thought they were going to get away with trying to unlive you, getting away with murder. They thought they were going to get away with it. Nope, you're not because we everybody know the truth. Everybody know what's going on. Everybody know the truth. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Whatever this is, it's big. This is big. Like, uh, stealing your identity big. And the judge play, playing along with it. The judge finna go and go to prison, too. We got a judge finna go to prison. Also, I'm seeing a judge falling out in court. Like, literally falling out. I don't know why. I guess because they caught. You know what I'm saying? They could be a part of money laundering. Or this person here that you were dealing with, they're part of laundering money. Yep, now they realizing the grass wasn't greener on the other side with this person who they were... With this damn karmic. You know what I'm saying? They realizing the grass was a green on the other side with this karmic. Scorpio, Sagittarius, Virgo, or Capricorn. You could be from Louisiana. Don't have to be. Yeah, okay. Like, they're going broke. Assets being taken. Uh, exposed the government. Exposed the community. So, your, I, you know, your enemies have been exposed within your community and within the government. You have a lot of people going against you, even the government. Then I say CIA because they, they did some type of experiment on you. Human experiment is right here. Or did I put it back? I think I put it back. But it was definitely, here you go, right here. Human experiment, illegal program. So they, they, they finna go to jail for that. You know what I'm saying? That's wrong on so many levels. That's wrong. How you gonna experiment on somebody without somebody consent? I didn't, bro, this is wrong. This is wrong. And I ain't gonna keep on saying it. Cause they know this shit wrong. Y'all grown just like I'm grown. Y'all know what y'all doing. And this false twin can get rid of them. This false twin, this false twin is your damn hit man. <laughs> On so many occasions, this person tried to get rid of you, but you still here. And if they think that they can come back and, and try to get in your good grace after you just tried to unalive me, you is a fool. You is a damn fool if you even think that that's going to happen. Because, you look, they hit the floor. You thought you were going to get away with my murder. <coughs> no, sir. That's not going to happen. But, yeah, whoever you are, like I said, be expecting some type of... Somebody's going to reach out to you and tell you something. Um... Uh, what you want to do with that information is what you do with that information. I feel like they would have came to you sooner, but they know that they going to get in trouble. You know what I'm saying? But whatever, they already asked, they already in trouble. They might well just do what they're going to do. Maybe they just want to make things, try to, want you to forgive them before they get ready to lay it down. Because they finna get ready to do some time. And then maybe they just want to amend things, make things right. You know what I'm saying? Just by saying, hey, I I did this, or I know this, or, you know what I'm saying? I played a part in this, because they asked through. It's through. Either way, it's through. Either way, they through. You know what I'm saying? Either way. But they definitely have been exposed. Your enemies have definitely been exposed. Okay, I hope they helped until next time. See you guys later. Bye. Make good choices.